Hello viewer, welcome to my YouTube channel Software Testing. Today I'll show you how to record Selenium IDE script and run that script with multiple sets of data. So watch the video till to the end, then you will be able to do the same thing. First I'll open Firefox browser as Selenium IDE is a browser add-in like Firefox, you can use Chrome, Microsoft S2. So once you will open the browser, then here is a Selenium IDE add-in. If you want to know how to install Selenium IDE and set up, then I have a separate video for that. I'll put that link in the description. You can watch for that, how to set up Selenium IDE. Now let's close the browser. And now I'll do the record a new test in a new project. So click the first link then it is asking the project name type project name project one you can insert the name whatever you want or it will be depend on your project so then once you enter the name then click ok so it is asking the url as today i'll do the google search so let me copy the google url and paste it over here then click start recording it is start recorded first i'll type search with the test soft usa then click google search button it, it is the search result once search result appear then we'll close the browser then stop recording then it is asking the test name test name is google google search then hit ok this is our recorded script in order to proceed further we need to verify this script is working or not so you can run this script and also you can set up the script runtime little bit slower like there is a clock icon in drop down click here it is the fastest is speed selected so you can slow down little bit then let's run it it is running google home page appear it is search with the tests of usa then close the browser that means our script is working fine now we need to insert the command for the for each loop right so first thing browser is open we need to insert the command then select the first row right click insert new command new command once first row is selected then type over here execute script this is the command then target at value return then open and closing bracket then insert the variable i'll insert three variable over here so first one is the test soft usa second one i'll insert bogura tech third one i'll insert soft wire testing this you can insert multiple variable let me test with the three variable this variable value will use that source name then it is done it is completed the execute script then we need to open we need to insert another row right click insert new command here is a row created for the command this command is for each then target is the search name whatever we assign in the execute script s e a r c h search name then value will assign let's say search value we need to let me copy the search value from here then for each loop started over here then we need to end that loop before closing the browser we need to insert another command with a row right click 
insert new command then here is the row selected command is end that means your for each loop start from the second row then it will execute the command then it will end that up in end command before ending we need to print the variable value in the log so in order to do that it is like a selenium web driver system dot out dot print ln it will um, print the console whatever the custom message it will put similar way we will put selenium ide right click insert new command select the row command is echo then value will do the variable once once we need to print the variable we need to put dollar sign then curly bracket then the variable name variable name is source value so once you will go to the loop every time source value it will print to the console and also we need to there is a hard coded value when we type in the source box test shop usa at that time instead of test shop usa hard coded value we need to insert the variable and that variable communicated with this executive script targeted test shop usa whatever value we will insert over here so in order to test shop usa we will insert the variable dollar sign curly braces within the curly braces we will put the source value that means it is completed our scripting after recording we just insert the command for each and echo is print value and execute script it is the all are the variable so let's complete the once complete the script then let me run it click over here run it is running you see it is test of usf first script run completed then again the second run is the bogura tech it is completed then it will run with the software testing software testing once it is completed then it will close the browser it is ended now you, if you see the log here is first one test of usa it is printed second one is the bogura tech third one is the software testing that means all are working also you can verify just inserting one more value over here let's see it work or not let's say first item test of usa before that we'll use another variable value like selenium ide so first it will search with selenium ide then test stop usa then bogura take then software testing like once a script is ready you can add multiple value over here and same script will be work for the all value so let me run again let's see the execution speed is little bit slow let me do it little bit faster so then run again click over here run button let me see how it works first it selenium ide look this is working as expected tests of usa second time third time it is running bogura tech then again fourth time it will run with the software testing that means it works fine at close the browser let me see the log first time it is run with let me be, get it first time it run with selenium ide eco printed second one test of usa third one bogura tech fourth one software testing that means this script is working as expected in this way you can run your script using for each command one script with multiple sets of data that's all for today's tutorial i think those who are new in selenium ide as well as for each command this video will be very helpful for themselves if you think this is helpful please like my video subscribe my channel and share it to others also if you have any question related to for each command and selenium ide recording script please make a comment i'll get back to you as soon as possible thank you for watching this video